Tonight, law enforcement around the country is tracking threats on social media related to school violence, the potential of it tomorrow. And although the threats are not credible, schools are doing everything they can to reassure parents that their students will be safe. CBS 2's Ali Bellman has the story. Eerie videos like these are making the rounds on social media, threatening students around the country not to go to school on Friday, December 17th. Every time a repost goes, it goes from town to town, it goes from state to state. So we don't even know where the origin starts. Nassau County is one of many police departments in our area monitoring the threats, which they essentially describe as clickbait. These kids are pushing it out and they have no idea what they're getting themselves into when they do this. A U.S. law enforcement official tells CBS News there is no known credibility to the threats, but school districts all around the tri-state area are stepping up patrols and sending letters home to reassure parents. The Fairlawn, New Jersey school district assures there is no specific threat, while Ridgewood superintendent writes messages such as this one are often posted to cause confusion and increase anxiety. And Scarsdale superintendent tells parents the posts are believed to have originated from outside the United States. Governor Phil Murphy tweeted in part, we will work closely with law enforcement to monitor the situation and remain prepared. They're generally, as I said, non-events. However, there's always the possibility that someone, that someone who has been, been, been thinking about perpetrating an incident like this may use that cue as a, as a trigger towards violence. Security expert David Katz says schools should always have an active shooter plan and be checking in on potentially violent students. So would you advise a parent to keep their child home from school tomorrow? No, I, I would not. These specific threats have to be taken very, very seriously. General threats, you know, assess your individual school. Law enforcement says while these threats are not credible, they do take officers away from dealing with real emergencies. In Fairlawn, New Jersey, Ali Bauman, CBS2 News.